Hello everyone, welcome back to Medical Pharma Lecture once again. This is Sunil Shah and today I am going to discuss an important question from examination point of view and this question belongs to limit test for iron where a question generally come like why ammonia is used in limit test for iron, okay? But before that I want to inform you that full version of this video is already available in pharmaceutical inorganic chemistry playlist in our channel. Okay, so without wasting time, let's go uh, to the question. So the question is like, why ammonia is used in the limit test for iron? Okay, so the answer should be like that. Okay, ammonia is, that is NS3, is added to make the solution or media, make the solution or media alkaline. Why? Because ferrous thioglycolate, which is produced by reacting ferrous with thioglycolic acid will give pink purple color only in alkaline media are you getting and it remains colorless okay so there will be no color if it is present in acidic or neutral media are you getting so if it is acidic or neutral media then you are not gonna get any color but if it is alkaline then definitely will get pink purple color okay so now we'll write the reaction so here is our ferrous Fe plus 2 plus 2 molecule of thioglycolic acid and this is citric acid and see what you have to do you have to write this molecule both the molecule in opposite direction okay like this and this remove this hydrogen of carboxylic group and make bond with ferrous and then from similarly due to the another carboxylic group and this sulfur you know they have lone pair they will share with this iron and we will get a um, complex like this now let's write the name in words okay so this is ferrous this is thioglycolic acid this is ferrous thioglycolate complex okay now if you will subject this complex into two different media one is acidic or neutral media and second one is alkaline media or in presence of ammonia so in acidic and neutral media we will get colorless and in alkaline media pink purple color will be produced okay so this is all about why ammonia is used in limit test for iron okay so that's all about this one so with this we came to the end of this discussion thank you thank you very much for watching our channel and uh, kindly subscribe our channel thank you thank you very much